What is the up, skis, everybody? This is GamerJax, and I'm bringing you a Call of Duty gameplay, a legit Call of Duty gameplay, and uh, a commentary to go with that. Alright, guys, so, uh, if you follow me on Twitter, you might know I've been playing this game, or if you see me on PS3, you might know I've been playing Modern Warfare 3 over, like, the weekend, and I'm probably going to play it today. I'm going to turn that down a little bit, so I hear myself here. Alright, so, I've been playing it, and, yeah, I probably said I'd never play it again, but more than likely, I just go on good long breaks away from the game come back a few months later and then you don't feel like it's so frustrating anymore it's um i think it's the best thing to do is to play it in little bunches like a weekend here take a good break play another weekend maybe a couple days you know and just take a good break from it until you know then that's i think that's the healthiest way you can play a call of duty because you play too much then all you want to do is complain bitch and moan about it and if you just play like a weekend or something I feel, I feel it's a lot funner to play like I've been playing it this weekend I, I'm thinking I'm having a pretty good time pretty good time uh, I even got a Moab yesterday so um, yeah I'm probably gonna upload that eventually once I get um, I gotta save that to my theater and everything before I forget <laughs> I gotta keep that one yeah so I, I did get a second Moab something I thought I'd never achieve again but I did it just you know it just kinda happened but yeah I'm gonna keep that for another gameplay. Um, I have this one for now. I don't even know if I posted this gameplay before. I think I might have. I don't know. If I did, my bad. Because uh, I don't remember what I posted last. I just usually just throw something in there. But, oh well. Um, yeah, so I'm not um, promoting my Twitter or anything. But if you do follow me on Twitter, I'm, I'm more than likely going to post when I'm playing Call of Duty. And you guys can play with me if you want. Uh, it's no problem. Uh, I probably won't play as much. But I might play a little more than I was maybe. I don't know. Uh, until I feel like I need to break away from it again, and I can play some other games. But right now, I'm kind of, kind of low on new games I want to play. Like I still have to finish my Assassin's Creed games because, uh, yeah, I gotta finish those. Uh, I just haven't. I don't know why. I just it's been like freaking two, three weeks since I played it since, and I, I really was enjoying it. But yeah, I gotta get back to that. But anyway, I want to talk a little bit about Call of Duty here, and it's just. What's really pushed me far away from Call of Duty lately is just the community itself, and I can't stand hearing people like, okay, we all know the ritual, we all know the the way Call of Duty works. A new Call of Duty comes out, it's the best Call of Duty ever made for about a month. And then once one month passes, everyone hates the newest Call of Duty, and then the previous Call of Duty is the best Call of Duty ever made, even though when it first came out, everyone thought it was the worst Call of Duty ever made, a.k.a. Black Ops. When that game first came out, everyone loved it and then hated it for Second Chance and Famous Ghosts and all that crap. Now all of a sudden it's Beast Ops. I don't get it. I, I, that's just I, what pissed me off. I, I didn't like it. Um, I just hate the community sometimes. It just blows my mind. It's like, if all you're going to do is complain, bitch, and moan about the Call of Duty game, then why are you going to play it? Play something else. Like it, It's just something that bothers me. I, I don't know why. Uh... Like, people, like, if all they want to do is play Call of Duty, you're missing out, like, the whole video game genre. Like, you have no idea what else is out there. And it disappoints me. Like, I, a lot of people don't even know what a Super Nintendo is. Some people don't even know what a Nintendo 64 is. No one's ever played Mario Party before. Never even heard of, like, playing a Mario, never even played a Mario game before. And that's just, that's just not acceptable. Like, if all you're going to do is play Call of Duty and you're not even going to like that game, you shouldn't be playing video games. But, um... The whole point of a game is to have fun with it. If you're not having fun with it, don't play it. But, um, obviously Call of Duty is a love-hate thing. You love it when you're doing good, and you hate it when you're doing bad. Every, when something's not going your way, you hate this game more than anything. But when you, you're you having a good game, you're having fun, you're having the greatest time in your life, you're just having fun. Um, it's probably better to play with friends. <laughs> I find I, I can't play this game by myself. I get too mad, so... And then I just say, nope, I'm not, I'm not having fun. I'm gonna turn it off, and we're gonna, we're gonna have, we're gonna have to play something else. We're gonna have to have some fun here. So, I don't, I don't want to play a game I'm not having fun with, or I can go watch a movie, or I can go hang out with someone. I'd, a million better things to do than to play a game that's pissing you off. Um, it's just a little message I'm trying to send out to the people. I, I just, I know it's, I have no right to tell you guys what to do. It's just my opinion. It's just how I feel about it. But um, yeah. Um, anyway. So, I know people don't like Twitter. I, I don't really like it either because on Twitter, all people do is rather complain about Call of Duty or um, complain about YouTube. And I know there's been YouTube problems lately. Like, um, uh, people are losing subscribers like left and right, like thousands of subscribers a day. And 
it's even hitting me like I've lost over 20 in the last week and I, I'm pretty sure that's just inactive subs because they did that before like I'm fine with that like it's just a number and um, if I'd rather have that real number I think that's maybe what YouTube's trying to do but I'm hearing things that YouTube is making people that are active still on their channel and making them unsubscribe to people that they're subscribed to and still watch and so on and so forth so yeah that's kind of weird but I, I think maybe they're just trying to get like that real number feel like yeah this is how many subscribers are actually watching your videos and so on so I don't know but um that's just kinda what the whole Twitter thing's been talking about when I read all my Twitter things um, you don't have to follow me it's just it's the easiest way for me to get in contact with people and tell them what if I'm playing Call of Duty or something because I do like playing Call of Duty with people it's I'm just a little I'm not I, you guys may not think this but I am shy at first like I'm really quiet and <laughs> I don't talk much I, I feel nervous but after I get to know someone I am like, you probably won't you probably wish I was quiet because I never shut the fuck up but I, I guess people think I'm funny so yeah um, so yeah you can go right ahead and and just ask but be polite like sometimes I have my friends in the lobby with me and don't be annoying because then they don't want to play with me anymore when because they always think I'm gonna play with my subscribers or something so just relax be normal and we'll just have a good time playing Call of Duty I guess because I we could use some teammates like I swear to god it's a two-man army every game <laughs> we always it's just always me and Kyle we go on a tear and we do everything for a team and we still lose so I don't, I don't know we need some extra people to play with us and most of the time we're just playing kill confirmed anyway, not hardcore kill confirmed, just kill confirmed. And there's the three piece and a biscuit. And <laughs> I said something funny the other day. I was like, um, I should have gotten a three piece, but I ended up only getting one and like two assists. I was like, what the fuck? I should have got a three piece and a biscuit instead I got a fucking happy meal. And I was like, no, nope, done, finished. That was that was the funny moment. You know, it was a good time. But um, yeah. So that was kind of my quick thought opinion on Call of Duty. I know I don't talk about it much anymore, but you know. I just been kind of keeping back, keeping out of it, because um, I'm just sick of people complaining about it. Like, find something else to play. That's all I can really say. Like, I know you play it a lot just so you can get that good feeling of having that good game. Like me yesterday, I was, I was livid. I got a Moab. I was happy. I was having fun. And then like, <laughs> you know, it ended ugly. But you know, that's just when it starts to get ugly. That's when you just turn it off <laughs> and go do something else. But um, yeah, that's pretty much all I had to say. Um. Be on the lookout for a Moab gameplay because it's coming. It's with the P90 and it's on carbon, so um, be on the lookout for that. And you can follow me on Twitter. I'll probably put the link in the bottom. If you don't have to go out and make an account for it, but just so you know, uh, I'll be announcing when I'm playing Call of Duty on it more than likely. So that's the gameplay. I hope you guys enjoy. I think I went 33 and 7, and I will see you guys in next game.